And then it looks like we also got uh, something else as well. Um, like a like an actual flamethrower. Um, sure, that's only a 1.0. Right. Stand here, we'll get Katana. Get Molotov. Molotov cocktail. Run in here, try and get some of this going. Okay, we got you. Run over here, grab... Yo, 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 everybody, what's going on? Is Lodi's here back with another zombie survivor episode? We're gonna jump right on into this. As you guys can see, we got all these guys already maxed out. We unlocked Pyro in the last episode. We're gonna jump right on in and we are gonna play some flipping Pyro and see how well this goes. See what we can unlock here. Um, should be pretty interesting. Um, could go Isolated City um, or we could go Vile, Wa Vile Wasteland. We went Isolated City with Boss Rush last time. Um, we could try and go one hit. We have to just survive five minutes. I don't think that should be too hard. Um, or we could Vile Wasteland Boss Rush as well and see how that goes, which I think that is what I'm going to do. Boss Rush and just to be able to unlock, we need to survive 10 minutes. Probably do that and then die or whatever. But the main reason is because I want to unlock one hit for this one as well. If you guys have been enjoying the content, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Every little bit counts, and I do greatly appreciate it as we are pushing our way to 1,000 subscribers. So it definitely is a little slow with starting out with this guy because you got to use the axe here. Okay, very interesting. I don't know if us picking, let's see, Molokov Tactile, Movement Speed, Weapon Cooldown Reduction, Elemental Damage. Oh, wow. Swing Heavy Fire Axe in a Circular Damage Attack Size. Reload Time is still 4 seconds. Okay, this is going to be very interesting to say the least. Uh, I really want to max out the Fire Axe ASAP just to see what is next. Okay, it looks like attack speed went up. That's, that's actually huge. It feels very good after the attack speed goes up. Uh, Blowtorch, Molokov Cocktail. Let's go Blowtorch. Okay. To be honest, the Axe felt a lot better as of right now. <laughs> Uh, let's go Molotov, and then we will go um, one of the other ones. The No Pain, No Gain, probably, is what I'm leaning towards. Yeah. The movement speed seems like it's going to be a flipping crazy. Okay. Let's do that again. 80% elemental damage. Holy smokes. Weapon cooldown being way jacked up too is insane. Like I know I have uh, those two up there. I'm holding off to, to push up there. I want to just see what uh, we got going on down here first. I don't really want to grab that yet. I think we need to survive like two hits from the uh, the sandworms. I think. Um, weapon attack speed. Weapon damage and attack speed. Weapon cooldown reduction, ability cooldown. Yeah, let's go that one. Let's go that one. See what it's all about. See what we got going on here. The one hit one, I feel like is going to take us a few tries. That one seems absolutely crazy. So we'll we'll try that one out. Uh, let's try Ghost. Um, let's go Molotov. Molotov Cocktail. Okay. So far, I feel pretty good. Blowtorch. Okay. I wonder if we could do just a straight up pyro pyro run. That could be interesting. Our third companion. I don't know who I'm going to want to take. Not sure yet. Haven't thought that far ahead. Um, obtain this item. Restore 100% elemental damage. Okay. Instead of taking uh, the sword person, we probably should have took like electric and freezing. I do need to do a, a freezing person, so I'm probably 
Oh. Oh, this is electric. Um, I'm probably going to end up taking medic again because we do need to get medic to... Um, ooh. No, I don't want to skip. I do want to get medic and then go the freezing route. Oh, I could have went huntress as well there, but we didn't. That's okay. That is okay. The bosses are really starting to funnel in now. A little worrisome. Um, let's just pump her handgun real quick. Just to try and get as much as we can. Let's go revitalization. Alright. Um, yeah, I'm just trying to get as much XP as possible at the moment. I do want to try and do the uh, 2,000 damage. Um, or what you call it? We do need to get five thousand kills. Um, with Pyro as the bot as the leader, which we're already we're not already there. <laughs> we're at five hundred kills so far. Uh, we need to get him to five thousand so we can unlock uh, the tier two weapons, and we'll see what that is all about. Um, it looked pretty cool because it looks like we got we get uh, like another type of axe of some sort. Um. And then it looks like we also got uh, something else as well, um, like a like an actual flamethrower. Um, sure, that's only a one point oh. Right. Stand here. We'll get katana. Get Molotov. Molotov cocktail. Run in here. Try and get some of this going. Okay, we got you. Run over here. Grab all this stuff. Um, yep, reanimation is huge. I think I called it revitalization before. <laughs> Alright, cool. Now we got a magnet. That should level us up a couple times. Um, we didn't get what I was hoping to get. That's okay. I wanted you. I want to see what uh, level 3 is. Actually, we won't get a level 3 because we haven't unlocked it yet. Oh, we got these bosses this round. Use that guy. Yep, chunk those. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, we also got the exploding um, scarabs as well. Interesting, interesting. Very, very interesting. Okay. Make our way over here. See what we got here. Anything good? Anything good? Sure, I'll take you. We already got the potato achievement, so I'm not too um, <clears throat> inclined on taking it. So that's okay. Gotta remember the scarabs do slow movement speed, so we gotta be careful on that front. Um, let's go you, critical protocol. <clears throat> Full on crit, baby. We're already at a thousand kills, that's pretty good. Three minutes in, not bad. We, we still need to survive just another uh, seven minutes, so it shouldn't be too bad. <clears throat> I don't know if we're gonna get um, <clears throat> a thousand damage off of these guys. Or not a thousand damage. Uh, two million damage, because I think we need two million, or maybe it's just a million. That we need to somehow get. Um, okay, perfect. Get those guys out of the way there. Uh, let's go stim pack. I was gonna go syringe gun there, but I'm gonna hold off for the moment. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Let's try and squeeze our way through. Rapid fire. Yep, legendary upgrade, baby. Can't say no to those. Can't say no to legendary upgrades. It's the exploding scarabs definitely do a good chunk of damage. Let's grab this guy. We haven't done any freezing damage yet. Um, yes. Snap, we're taking a lot of damage, which is not good. The exploding scarabs definitely does not help <laughs> whatsoever. Okay. Ouch. Run over here. Let's do you. I just need to heal up as much as possible. Um, I'll take Katana. Splash. Grab you. I'm about to run right into that freaking beetle. Yep. 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 Um, yep, regen. Okay, there's some healing. More healing. 
There's this guy here. Uh, life steal chance. Totally taking that. More life steal, the better right now. Because that's where we're. Uh, that's where like I'm, I'm seeing us struggle the most. Is the life steal? Okay, we're back to full HP. There is an upgrade over here. It looks like. Shield, take you. Keep making our way over here. Okay, we got you. I think that's everything on the map so far. That's worth picking up. Grab the syringe gun and see what we got going on here. Um, so far, so good. Um, I, I don't see the the scarabs definitely hurt a bit. So like that was our like one like worrisome like thing. But um, as of right now, I think I think we're okay. I don't think we need to worry too much. Uh, let's take the syringe gun. Next one can be hopefully the freezing, uh, freezing uh, grenade or whatever. Um, we'll grab you. Ton of splash, bay B. Yeah, we're looking good so far. Oh, that actually hit us. Um, open a chest creates an explosion around survivor pushing the enemies back when you get hit with a 25%. An explosion area weapon. Okay, let's go attack speed. Let's go attack speed. Oh, excuse me. Slowly making our way down through here. All right. Ooh, ooh, dodge, 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 bob and weave, bob and weave. Ooh, ooh, dodge. Okay. Okay, not bad, not bad. Ooh, that one hurt a bit. Um, wind cutter we could go, but you know me, I love my uh, thousand cuts, so we're gonna save up and uh, save for that guy. We gotta survive another three and a half minutes. So far, so good. I'm trying to get the full damage. That's what I'm leaving for, at least. Let's grab you, get you out of here. Get you out of here. Grab this guy. Don't want you. Grab shurikens. Okay. Make our way over to this crate now. Alright. How many chest grants you? Um, you know what? Yeah, sure. Sure, why not? Why not? Why the heck not? Okay. Been good so far. Still not what I want. Hollow Ghost. Grab you. Okay. Been good so far. Hopefully that guy can wipe out some stuff. Hey, freezing flasks. That's what I wanted. Hmm. Okay. Freezing flasks again. I did see a thousand cuts there. Hello, ghost. Take you. Oh, there's freezing flasks there. Take freezing flasks. Okay. The reason why I'm taking freezing flasks is mainly because I'm trying to get the freezing flask. I'm trying to get as much cold damage as possible, basically, before the end of the run. Um, just because I don't think I'm going to try and go for a freaking hour like we did the last time. That was a bit extreme. I just wanted to see how long we could last, and I'm we could have went a lot longer. <clears throat> we definitely could have won a lot longer. Um, let's reroll. Okay, let's grab you. Pyro seems pretty okay. I mean, we're up to 3,000 kills. We need 2,000 more, and I'll be happy with that run. 2,000 more Pyro kills, and then, like, of course, if we can get more, um, more damage... More damage would be nice. More like cold damage specifically would be pretty nice. But it's all right. He's all right. Uh, let's go field surgery. Get that regen going, baby. Looks like we got another upgrade thing down here, which we'll actually end up getting it as well. I'm very curious on how the one hit will go. Um, that'll be very interesting to see. Um, let's go movement speed. 
Love my movement speed. Okay. Oh, there's a crate actually over here. Make my way over here to this crate to see what we got. Alright. Not bad. Two minutes to go. Or less than two minutes to go. Less than two minutes to go. Okay. To do healing bonuses and fire modifier. Yes, please. Because we also have the uh, achievement to get the uh, two million fire damage or a million fire damage as well. So I'm going fire and cold to try and max both of them. We're trying to try to get basically both of the achievements at the same time, um, if possible. If possible. Which so far I don't know. I don't. I, I doubt we're gonna get it um, in this run because I am trying to go for. <laughs> I'm trying not to do an hour run again. So like us getting both of those achievements, I feel like are gonna be probably slim. But at least we're working towards them. That's all that matters. At least we are working toward them. Um, let's grab you. Okay. And we're almost to 10 minutes, 30 seconds to go. Okay, we've already done a million fire damage. That's pretty gnarly. I was not expecting that whatsoever. Um, so that's pretty cool. Where are we sitting on the cold damage? 34,000. That's not very good. <laughs> that's not good. We don't have actually a straight up ice character like we do with the fire guy and uh, the engineer. We don't have a guy that just does straight up cold damage, so I wonder if that's going to be the next character that they come out with. Because, like, if you think about it, we have we have the hunter and we have the medic here, but, um, but they um, they lay all enemies in the extermination mode in the vile wasteland. Okay, cool. But we don't have like just a straight up ice character. So, yeah, I think the ice um, one, unfortunately, is going to just take some time to do, um, sadly. Oh, that was just us surviving the 10 minutes. Okay. I was like, what the heck? We didn't eliminate all the bosses. But that, make, that makes sense now. Um, sure. So that's cool. That's pretty cool. Um, so, yeah, we got that. Um, I do want to try and, like, upgrade most of these. Okay. Okay. Um, Alright. Good so far. So we survived the boss one. We got that achievement, which is pretty cool. Um, I guess the next thing is to work towards getting the cold damage, which, like I said, that's just most likely not going to happen this run. Um, just based on the, um, the amount of cold damage that we've already done. Um, I do want to see something though real quick. Uh, let me run actually over here Grab this. I want to I want to check something out um, Boom and then if I do this um, Achievements, so we're looking at Survive the night as pyro's team leader. So we're gonna have it to do another run on like one of the other runs um, Survive five minutes of the one hit mode in isolated city. Okay unlock second pyro rank. We're working towards that which will give us the flamethrower and the infernax. Then we got makeshift bomb and firewalk. Firewalk sounds insane. We're going to need 25,000 kills, it looks like. Um, five minute in vile wasteland. Complete a run in default mode with dealing any elemental damage. Without dealing any... That one seems like it's going to be tough. Um, complete a solo run in hardcore mode with just 18 liter. Okay. I think we should be able to do that. Walk five kilometers in total with your feet on fire. Okay, so we need to unlock fire walk before we do that. Deal a million ice damage. That one's going to take some time. Survive 20 minutes without picking any abilities. In a single run, get hit by the worm five times and survive. Um, survive 20 minutes without upgrading any weapons. So yeah, we're going to try and do this one. Get hit by the worm five times. We'll see if we can make that happen. It's going to be tough on this run. But we'll see. We'll see. We will try. We will try. Okay, um, I don't think I got hit there. Okay. 
so that we're gonna try for that achievement and then I think we'll have just like one more vile wasteland run to basically do I think I think we might we might not have to no we will because we'll have to run um <laughs> okay so we got hit there I think um we're gonna have to run um uh the one hit mode survive five minutes with the one hit mode so there's at least going to be like four maybe five more episodes of this uh of another you know, zombie survivors and then uh yeah that'll be it until the next update um but i think we still have like four maybe five episodes of this we'll see though we'll see might be able to cram a couple of them into uh one um one episode but I, I am trying to go for that, uh, let's see, defeating boss grants you three percent percent, a little, 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 sure. I am trying to go for that, uh, worm one right now. I think we've gotten hit twice, maybe, potentially. I don't know, though. I do not know. Thank you. Okay. All right, kunai dance. Yeah, we definitely got hit there. We might be up to three. I think. <laughs> it's hard to tell. Because I'm not really paying attention to my health when I'm getting hit by the worm. So I, I think we're at three. I, I honestly don't know. This could be four. Okay. Chemical damage modifier, pills, um, bum, 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 bum. Let's go weapons. Okay, run over this way. So I think we need to just get hit by the worm once more. Hopefully, hopefully it's once more. Okay. Where are you at, baby? Where are you at? Yeah, if you guys enjoyed this uh, episode, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. I'd greatly appreciate it. Also, if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Every little bit counts, and I do greatly appreciate it once again. Um, oh, please be the last time. Hey, we got that achievement. Sweet. So we got hit by the worm five times. That is huge. Um, I think we can basically get wiped out if we wanted to now, because cold damage uh, cold damage is at 117. We are over 5,000 kills. I mean, the more kills we go, the closer we will get to uh, 25. Um, so, I mean, we can continue this. Um, it doesn't hurt to continue it just a little longer. Um, I mean, we are at 117, so it might take a hot minute to get to... Um, the million but i think we'll definitely i'm at least gonna try and get close now is it in one run i wonder um let's do you let me do you do you where you at where you at where you at i think it's this one you know total of a million ice damage in a single run okay so it is in a single run i mean we're already up to 133 so we gained what 20k off of uh off of that so i mean not too bad not too bad i do need a a thing to increase uh cold damage that would be cool like the like increase uh cold damage uh multiplier or something that would that would help out a good bit i feel like ability cooldown luck we'll see we shall see okay so I think the one to do um, no damage, no um, elemental damage in a run, I think we'll have to run SWAT. And that should be easy, because we could literally run, like, we could run a normal run, and I think we'd be fine. Run a normal run, and I think we'd be fine. Um, the picking up no abilities and no weapons will be very interesting. But, I mean, like I said, we could also just do, like, a normal run and knock it out. Because you survive 10 minutes and, yeah, it should be easy. Okay, we unlock the second rank as Pyro. That's huge. So, I mean, we need to get, like, another 20,000 kills. 
with Pyro, which will probably be like 30,000 up here would be my guess. I don't think we're going for that <clears throat> this episode. Because like I said, I don't want to... I don't want to go for another hour, another hour run, even though we definitely easily could. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I'm just not, uh, not about that. Um, I'm, I am taking a bunch of weapon stuff right now because I want to try and get, um, like I said, as much cold damage as possible. We're going for a million. Um, I, we have to, we'd have to be over 200k by now. Not even 200k? Oh my gosh, dude. Okay, yeah, I think we're gonna just scrap it this run, and we're gonna try and do uh, the Huntress. The Huntress might be a little better. Uh, we might take her as the actual... Um, as the actual leader in the run when we do it, and uh, we'll try it out that way, because the Medic just is not dishing out a lot of cold damage. Unfortunately. Unfortunately. Like, where are we sitting now? Yeah, 174. Yeah, she's not doing a whole lot, sadly. So, we're probably going to scrap it, and, uh, yeah. I mean, we got a bunch of achievements this run, so that was pretty cool. That was pretty cool. Um, weapon damage. Okay. To be honest, we survived a lot longer than I thought there. That was actually pretty crazy. You succeeded, um, survived the night with Pyro as the team leader. Oh, so we got that one too. Okay, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Um, I mean, we got a bunch of achievements unlocked. Got tier two of the Pyro. Um, yeah, next run will probably be, let's see, probably one hit mode, trying out the one hit mode in Isolated City. Then we could do, uh, one hit mode in Vile Wastelands. Um... We can try and do this one as well. Probably not in the next episode. Um, we might try and knock out the one hits in uh, the same episode. And then we will... I'll probably run Pyro on both of them. Just to try and get more kills to, to unlock uh, Tier 3 of Pyro. Um, this one we could probably try and do with Pyro. A million ice damage. I'm going to try and run the Huntress and see if we can get that to happen. Um, because I don't think we have... Somebody that does straight up ice damage. No. So yeah, I might try and run her. See how that works, but hopefully you guys enjoyed, like I said. And uh, yeah, don't forget to subscribe if you guys are new. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.